Welcome back to NSUSpartans.com as the Spartans fall today on the road at Marshall by a score of 45-7 to here with head football coach Latrell Scott and coach the game got off to a great start a little bit like Rutgers a couple weeks ago opening drive touchdown you had to be pretty happy with uh, how things looked on that first drive. Well we're excited about the way we played in the first drive uh, didn't play very well much after that but uh, credit the kids for uh, not quitting you know we, we battled through this three game stretch and then we're looking forward to getting the conference play. Uh, another game where um, some success from the other school in the uh, uh, in this case Marshall on the ground Devon Johnson it was just a matter of uh, some bigger bodies in there that uh, that, that kind of wore you, you guys down a little bit well I think so uh, bigger bodies probably got to us I don't think we missed nearly as many tackles as we did a week ago so I'm proud of that but uh, obviously uh, you know when you step up a level in competition you've got to step your game up and you know, we just weren't able to do that today coach you touched on it three road games against three FBS teams obviously a uh, difficult schedule to start the season for your team but um, some, some more positives to take away from from this game as you head into the opener next week against Tampa well you know first things first we're not going to make excuses about our schedule we knew what it was and we knew we had to play it but I think I'm moving into conference play I believe we're battle tested uh, we know what we can do we know what we can't do and that uh, we're optimistic going forward through the season uh, first uh, Really some explosive plays from Gerard Johnson that we've seen this year. Uh, got it going quickly with a 40-yard catch and then the touchdown. Also found some, some uh, room on the ground running. What did you see out of Gerard today? Well, you know, we, we made an effort to get him the ball and try to get him out in space, and I thought he performed well. Uh, you know, they made some adjustments and closed some of those rush lanes down in the second half. But uh, as the season goes, Gerard's going to be our go-to guy. Uh, Shaquem Copeland came in and gave us some good carries today. I think all three of the wideouts caught some balls. Uh, you know, Greg wasn't as sharp as he normally is, but, but he'll be fine going forward. And like I said, we're just looking, looking forward to, to getting home and playing in front of uh, the people that care about us. What will be the message to your team this week? Uh, certainly uh, probably not much of a rah-rah speech needed to come home for the home opener against their big rival in Hampton. Well, you know, it's not about a rivalry. It's not about a home opener. It's still about uh, winning, winning the first game. Uh, you know, we, we've played uh, three times and had one, and, and when you have a, a group uh, that, that's as prideful as our guys are, it's tough to be 0-3, but, but uh, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll pull ourselves up by our bootstraps and be ready to go next Saturday. All right, Coach. Well, uh, rough stretch to start the season. I know you're uh, looking forward to getting back home, seeing the home fans, and uh, big MEAC opener next week against Hampton. Safe travels, and we look forward to seeing you next week in Dick Price Stadium. Thanks, Matt. Once again, that's Latrell Scott here for the Spartans. Head football coach following the Spartans' 45-7 loss here today at Marshall. Make sure to join us next Saturday, 4 p.m. kickoff at Dick Price Stadium as the Spartans take on Hampton, the home opener and the MEAC opener next Saturday for Norfolk State. For more information, make sure to log on to NSUSpartans.com.